What's going on, guys? Your boy Gamer Guy not here. Bring you guys Madden 15 Ultimate Team, the Super Bowl, man. We are in the championship, the grand stage of all, the Super Bowl, trying to bring home this Lombardi trophy. Remember, you guys, I told you I took a break of mutt. But now we're back. We're back. We are back on the, um, this is like my, not, not, well, before this whole current season that you guys watched, I think it's pro first string season. Before you guys, before the first pro, pro first string, like when I was in like rookie, after rookie second string, I took a break, came back. So this is like, I'm pretty much rusty at this game. So I'm looking at this man's line. I'm like, yo, this man got, look at this dude's squad. Oh, this man's pretty stacked. But, um, yeah, but I came back, man. I can't believe we went undefeated. The first, like, my first, like, I came back to Madden, like, after a month. Like, I promise you, you guys, anybody, I took, like, a month break from Madden. This was, this video is kind of old. This is, like, around February, I believe. February, March. I took a break from Madden. But it was, it's so funny because I went undefeated throughout my whole first year. And now we're in the Super Bowl. This man has a Ronnie lot, like, tsh, Lord Jesus. But now we're not looking at me. Look at my expression on that. says all, that says a lot right there. But now when our Super Bowl, man, when we get matched up against an OP squad, can the 87 overall team pull it off against this all 90 squad? I think it seems like around the 96. I say 96, 97. No, I think I'd say 95, 96 from an 86 overall standpoint. So it's pretty much an 87 overall team going against a nine, above a nine, definitely above 94 overall. I can tell you that much. Then right here we got RG3, man, trying to win his first Lombardi trophy. Shout out to all the Redskins fans trying to make your boy RG3 look nice right here in the Super Bowl. Ooh, Ronnie Lott just got juked by my boy John Brown. I think it's John Brown, Josh Brown, one or the other. Hit the screen with Doug Martin. And um, look at this. Look at Doug Martin go, man. Look at Doug Martin go. But hopefully you guys, you know, enjoyed the draft. Um, you know, hopefully your team, your teams got who you wanted out of the draft and what position was definitely needed. My team, the Falcons. Definitely got who I would project it again. You see Dante Fowler Jr. And look at this, man. Look at look at this. But we got Dante Fowler Jr. and Vic Beasley. Not not both, but I was either going to pick Dante Fowler Jr. or Vic Beasley, possibly. But we got Vic Beasley. So, um, you know, terrible news. Dante Fowler Jr. You know, I feel bad for all the Jaguars fans because, you know, towards ACL, he's out for the season. That definitely sucks. I don't wish no harm or no player whatsoever, man. No matter how much I hate him or not. Like, I hate Drew Brees' own, you know. Back then, I first started watching football, you know, I used to wish everything. But now, nah, like, no, nah, it's not, you know, ain't really much of a big deal. I'm kind of is, but at the same time, it's kind of isn't. But I'm um, back to this game play. We're trying to get a stop here on defense, a lockup, and Chris Culver, man. I, I got to get rid of Chris Culver, man. I thought it was good when they dropped him. My man Nizzy told me to pick him up. But I'm like, man, I don't, I don't, I don't want this guy no more. He's been suspect ever since I got him. And look at that. That's, what a fumble that, man. So right here, second to go, man. He looking, looking, looking. I'm all over that, all over that. They can't even give me the animation. They can't even give me the animation. I have nothing to say. So now we're down, down four points here, man. Trying to hit, trying to get a touchdown. Hit up Doug Martin wide open. This is what I can't understand about screens. Like, look at this. My offensive lineman goes to the right. I'm running to the left. Like, can you guys kind of, you know, pick up the pace, man, and get in front of me so you can pick up the blockers? Like that guy just did right there. And how dare he use that glitch on me to bring me down? Right here, we're looking. We hit up Malcolm Floyd for the first down move in the chains. I'm actually kind of surprised my team's putting up a fight against this glitchy team. Like, but yeah, his pass rush was definitely getting in. And they go Jack Ham just being annoying. Got that little 999 some thousand awareness. Look at me, man. My line just swallowed. I'm just getting pushed around, sacked, none all over the place. And we was forced to settle for a field goal. So now we're still down, man. Trying, and then we're trying here, trying to get another stop. And my boy Sean Lee comes through with a pick, man. That's definitely what we needed. Get a little bit of momentum here. Then, you know, you try to put up, try to put up some points on the offensive side of the ball. So we have Doug Martin right there. Oh my God, man. That A that A work tackle is so annoying. So many people use it. It's so it's so annoying, I promise you. Um, so right here, we're looking, we're looking, we're looking. Then look at this. Check this out. RG3 rolling out and make it just make people miss left and right. That's the advantage I have of him. But like I said, we was forced to sell for another field goal. But you guys definitely take note of this. When you have a turnover, always take your points. Always. I mean, always, no matter what the circumstances is, always take your points off a of turnover, man. Especially if it's a close game, because you guys never know it. it might come at to bite you. And then right here, Antonio Kamari catches the pick, but if only number 20 I could get in front of him and block him, he probably possibly could have had a pick six. But it's all good right here. 
Look, Chris Clove again targeted. Once again, man, picks up another first down. This man Tom Brady trying to show off RG3 in the Super Bowl right here. And right here, I got to use a pick, man. He tested me, and he definitely failed that test. And like one man to beat, we spin out Tom Brady because you know he can't tackle for nothing. Then we got brought down. So now we're up two points, man. And I was definitely looking for, you know, definitely looking to put get a, get a touchdown, possibly. I really want a touchdown, man, because we've been struggling all day with these field goals. So right here, we up another screen, man, and Doug Martin. Gets down, picks another first down. So right here, we're looking for someone to get open. We're looking, we're looking, we're looking. And like I said, I just keep getting bring down, man. I thought I threw the ball for RG3's right-handed. So then right here, man, second and 23, hit up Malcolm Floyd. You know, get closer to that touchdown. It's so hard to get in this end zone, man. The struggle is real. Right here, check this out. RG3 rolls out, misses one, and then just goes into the end zone, man. Like, get off me, man. Look at RG3. Let's get a replay for that one more time. This man takes off. Runs around, makes one defender miss it, then just, 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 just get off of me, man. And we end up getting a touchdown, and let's just go ahead and celebrate like the Heisman Trophy winner. RG3 is trying to, uh, he's out here trying to prove Tom Brady that, hey, the new generation is here, man. We tired of, you know, people like you, you know, Peyton Man and all these other old timers, you can get Super Bowls. Time for the new generation. It's time for something new. It's time for something new. Look at me, RG3 just throws one guy off of me. And right here, we're looking, we're trying to get out the scrambling. RG3, look at him go, man. And then shout out to him not fumbling right there. I bet you my opponent was mad. I know he was mad because RG3 was a fumble. It just making his defense look silly. So right here, man, this is 85 RG3 at that. Move, make him a juke, but then we get bro brought down again. We're just getting sacked all again. But shout out to RG3 for not fumbling. But like you got, like I told you guys, always take your points, man. As you guys can see, it is 19 to 7. So we were taking our points. So then right here, four quarters winding down. We're trying to close it out and get the Super Bowl win. This Lombardi trophy. And my opponent's not going away. You definitely still got plenty of time, man. Still got, you know, too many one or two timeouts. You definitely still got plenty of time. But that right there just sealed the deal. I cannot believe me and Joan Green. This isn't 99. This ain't the glitchy one. It's the free one the EA gave out. Come through with a pick. And I don't blame him. I would have quit too after that. I do not blame him. Make sure you got a like, comment, subscribe. Definitely subscribe to my Let's Play channel. Link in the description below. I'm out. Peace.